Hello, my name is Vinay Kumar Verma and I am from Thapar University, Patiala. This video is about my thesis work on cryptography and image authentication. And thesis title is a multi-level hybrid chaotic crypto system and image authentication for digital images under the supervision of Dr. Singh Hara Singh. First of all, I give a brief introduction about cryptography. Cryptography enables you to store sensitive information or transmit it across insecure network so that it cannot be read by anyone except the intended user. This diagram will show that plain text is encrypted using the encryption key and converted into ciphertext. This ciphertext is transmitted through the insecure network and at the receiver end the ciphertext is again converted back into plain text using the decryption algorithm. In the digital world, we not only need to transmit the textual data but also need to transmit the multimedia data like video, images, audio, etc. For transmitting such type of multimedia data, conventional cryptography is not advisable due to their large data size and real-time constraints. So, for multimedia data, we move to chaotic functions. Chaotic functions are simple functions and they are iterated quickly. By using chaotic functions, decrypted image is usually acceptable even if it contains a small level of distortion. There are various image editing tools are available in the market, so we need to verify the verify and authenticate the images. For this purpose, we use image hashing methods. Image hashing method can extract the important feature of image and a hash matrix is generated to represent the image contents. Such type of hash functions are robust um, for image content preserving operations while being sensitive to various malicious tampering attacks. This diagram will represent the process of encryption. Here the secret image is working like a private key. The plain image and secret image are encrypted using the RSA encryption uh, algorithm for P and Q rounds respectively. Now the result of these two images sequentially XOR Due to this, the pixel of plain image will be modified according to the secret image. Now the output of this step is given the input to the plain image again and this process will continue up to R rounds. Finally, the output after the R round will be the cipher image. Decryption algorithm In this process, first of all, the secret image is encrypted for Q into R rounds for inverse pixel modification. The result of this phase is decrypted using RSA and decryption for P rounds and the output is again input to the cipher text and this process will continue up to R-1 round. After R-1 round, the output from the RSA decryption algorithm will be the decrypted image or plain image. image authentication algorithm. This image authentication scheme basically consists of three parts, pre-processing, second is feature extraction and third is hash construction. In the pre-processing part, the image will be rotated about 45 degree angle and apply averaging filter to it. In the feature extraction part, first apply the low polar transform to the output image of the pre-processing step and then apply the DWT transformation. Now XOR the result of both transformations and in the last step is hash construction. In this a hash matrix is constructed using R0 transformation applied to the output image of the previous step. Now this hash matrix is transmitted with the original image and at the receiver end, the receiver will apply the same process on the image. If the hash matrix of the both images are same, then there will be no tampering with the image, otherwise there is just some tampering with the image.
experiment results and analysis key space analysis in proposed crypto system the combination of different parameters will provide a large key space of approximate 2 to power 250 so this will show the very large key space analysis for key sensitivity analysis the table will show the result of difference rate of two encrypted images with slight change in parameters This table will show the difference rate between plain image and decrypted image with slight change in parameters.